Floods. Did you know that there are actually three different types of floods? Seriously. Today, we are going to talk all about this watery phenom. So get your raincoats ready. First, let's talk about what a flood actually is. Simply put, a flood is an overflow of water onto what is normally dry land. Floods can be a few inches high to around 20 feet high, depending on the circumstance. And floods can vary in size too. Floods form in different ways. River overflow, heavy rains, tsunamis, hurricanes, melting ice, and dams or other barriers breaking can all cause flooding. And sometimes, more than one of these things can happen at once. Here's an interesting fact. The most destructive river flood in the history of the United States happened almost a hundred years ago in the spring of 1927. It is now known as the Great Mississippi River Flood. It happened because of extremely heavy rains, which caused river levels to rise so high that they breached or broke the levee system controlling the Mississippi. A levee is a natural or artificial wall that is designed to block water from going somewhere it shouldn't. The Great Mississippi River flood affected states all along the river from Illinois down to Louisiana. At the height of the flood, the southern part of the river swelled to be 80 miles wide. That's a bigger area than some cities. Now that we know the basics about what causes a flood, let's talk about the three different types of floods. The first is slow onset, which means that the flooding happens gradually, over a longer period of time. Most of the time, this happens when bodies of water overflow their banks. This process can happen over days or even weeks. Next is rapid onset which happens more quickly, usually a day or two. There is normally enough time for a warning in case you are in the flood's path. Last is the most dangerous type of flood, flash. Flash floods happen during a very short period of time, usually between two and six hours. But sometimes a flash flood can cause destruction within a few minutes. You might be asking yourself if floods can be prevented. Well, not exactly. But planting trees with good root systems can help minimize flood damage. These roots help soak up flood water, making it less destructive to the land. Nice! And floods aren't all bad. Sometimes they can leave behind nutrient-rich soil that helps plants grow. We have learned from fabulous facts about floods. Let's review. True or false? Flash floods are the most dangerous type of flood. True. Fill in the blank. There are blank different types of floods. Three. What is the name of the most destructive flood in the history of the United States? The Great Mississippi River Flood. Fantastic work, friends. Floods are an interesting phenomenon caused by various factors. Maybe one day you will study floods and come up with some new and exciting ways to manage them. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.